So sorry guys, I accidentally hit the, the stop button on my old video, so <laughs> this is part two. Um, continuing where we left off on the first video, I'm sorry about that. Anyway, let's get right back into it. So we were talking about this new person coming in, this, um, we have this King of Wands, King of Pentacles, I think it's the same person here, it's just somebody who's passionate, loyal, somebody who's got their finances together, somebody who's worked hard for everything they have. This could be like a workaholic type person too. I kind of feel like they're aware, you know, in that first video we talked about the King of Swords, your ex coming back around, but it was the same toxic energy. I feel like this person could be aware of that, especially if they're a coworker, that would make sense. Maybe you've talked to people around them about it, but it's kind of like, because we have the tower here. It's like this, this shock, this brutal shock, this heartbreak with the ex, but it was the closure that you needed. But I'm almost wondering if this new person is aware of this energy. They might not, maybe you haven't said anything, but maybe they've just been kind of observing you and they can just kind of have this sense whether they actually know or not, they might just have this sense that you're not really emotionally available or that there's another person coming back around or, or in your life. Like they just might have this sense that you're um, that you're not really in a place where you want to open your heart to love. They Or they might just get that feeling for whatever reason. So it's kind of like they're in this higher front energy where they're kind of just being logical and grounded and steel and I, again i think this is kind of an old-fashioned person and they're just focusing on their finances and their wealth but they do have these feelings for you let me pull some more cards really quick and see what else i can get okay so this person notices you but might be afraid to come forward they might just not think that you're ready or that you want that again i do get the co-worker energy or somebody that's kind of around you that's watching you so let's see what's going on so what else can you tell me about this king of pentacles like what's just the final what's what could happen like where could this go you know if, if the if the viewer gives this a chance, kind of notices the people around them a little bit more, where could this connection go? Like, what are, what are the details? Please give me a clear, direct message about what this connection is with the King of Pentacles. Clear, direct messages. This is pretty good. Okay, we got the Ace of Swords reversed. The Hermit. So this could be somebody who's a bit introverted that's a little bit afraid to talk to you. That would make sense. Strength, Queen of Pentacles, Four of Cups, Five of Cups, Knight of Swords. So this is probably somebody who's just like a secret admirer maybe at work or just somebody who's aware of you that may have not come forward with their feelings yet or this could be someone in the, in the near future that you're going to meet especially if you're looking for a new job that would make sense but they don't feel like they have clarity like they're not in this very strong energy where they feel like they can come forward this could be somebody who's a bit socially awkward kind of introverted um They've worked hard for everything they have. Like I said, I get this kind of, um, this stable energy with them. This this King of Wands, King of Pentacles, I think it's the same person. And then your ex would be the King of Swords. And it's, it's somebody who's passionate, maybe a little bit nerdy too. Um, kind of sweet and nerdy, passionate, fi financially successful or very like focused on their finances um, or, or, or on school or on some sort of... Uh, hobby or something that would make them money or career it's something to do with finances like that but but they do have this stable kind of old-fashioned energy they they probably are a little bit of an introvert they probably are somebody that just kind of sits back and watches and observes i don't feel 
they're not like a weak person, but I don't feel like a life of the party kind of energy from this person. I feel like I feel somebody who's probably more of the quiet type, somebody who would just kind of watch you, but maybe not say anything, not in a creepy way, but just somebody that would observe and really feel somebody out before coming forward to talk to them. Somebody who might be a little bit logical in that sense. This is somebody who would probably want to know all the facts before pursuing you. This is somebody who might have maybe some control. I don't want, not like severe control issues, but they just, they want to be aware of the, with the situations they're in. They don't like to dive into things head first. They like to know what the situation is before pursuing somebody. So if they have any sense that you have a, that you already have a person or that you have some drama going on with an ex or that maybe just your energy, you don't seem fully open which would if this is a co-worker that might make sense because when you're at work you're probably not trying to flirt at work you're probably just trying to focus on yourself on on you know getting through the day um and, and for everyone it's not going to be a co-worker but for some of you it is definitely there is that energy there so yeah this person is introverted i feel like they're they see you as their queen of pentacles though they see you as somebody who could be their match they might take a while to open up to people but I, I do I don't get a bad energy from them um, they might tend to be overly logical sometimes and they kind of need to just let go and just live and just allow themselves to be more emotional and not overthink things but there I don't get a bad energy from them though but they're trying to be strong and they're trying to come towards you because they do see you as their queen of pentacles they do see you as this person that could match them that could match their energy and if they know about the ex, then it makes sense why they're not coming forward because, again, they, they want to have that security before they come forward. They want to know that they're not going to get hurt, that they're not going to screw themselves over and get cheated on or, or get dumped for the ex. So with the Four of Cups, I think that they kind of... I think this person does have empathy. Like, they have... I know I probably describe them in a way that sounds kind of boring. I don't think that they're necessarily boring. I think that... I think they're damaged just like we all are. They're, you know, we're all pretty damaged, but I think that they they handle their damage, they handle their past in a different way. I feel like they've become kind of isolated and introverted, and they're just more careful now. You know, some people lash out, some people get angry, some people, everyone re reacts to their own baggage in different ways, you know what I mean? Some people get angry, some people are really emotional. This person is kind of more just overly cautious these days. Like, they really feel the situation out and they open up pretty slowly and they want to make sure it's a sure deal before they ask somebody out or or give their all to somebody they they're just they're more cautious these days they're more logical they were probably more emotional in the past but they probably got hurt so much that these days i think they're and these days i think they're probably a little bit more logical about everything and it probably they you know much slower to open up but they're trying to be strong and they're trying to come forward for their queen of pentacles i do feel like they're really empathetic though i feel like they're so either they actually are aware of the situation with your ex like you've actually told them or or, or told people around them or told or told their friends or something and it got back to them and they know the situation with your ex maybe there's some gossip going around here and so they they know the situation with your ex what even if you're not aware that they do for others it could just be energetically like they might just sense that you've been hurt a lot maybe it's in your eyes maybe it's in your energy the way you carry yourself just something that kind of or maybe something you're posting on social media just something that kind of lets them know that you've been through a lot that you have a big heart and you've been through a lot and that's that could be a big part of why they connect so much with you too because they also have a big heart and they've kind of been isolated and they probably feel alone around a lot of people and they're very cautious about opening up to new people and so it's like they kind of set you apart from the rest they see you as different than everybody else with this four of cups and the five of cups they feel like they have this awareness that you were bored and dissatisfied and, and depressed and unhappy with your life in the past and that you know this ex hurt you this person these people hurt you these people left you you were rejected, you were abandoned. And I think that this person wants to, I feel like this person feels very protective of you. Like I feel like they, they're aware of this energy, they're aware of the pain that you've been through and they don't want to do that to you. They want to make these vows to you to, to come in with this very strong masculine energy 
whether they're male or female, however it plays out for you, but they want to come in with this very strong energy and make these promises to you and not put you through the things that other people have put you through. They want better for you. They want something different for you. So there is that energy there. Um, just keep in mind, though, that they might need more reassurance before they come forward. They, they want more security first, and they want to make sure the ex is out of the picture before they're going to come forward with any love offer. So that's where you guys are at now. Please, um, if this resonates, like, share, subscribe, comment. Let me know what's up. Thank you guys for watching.